Hi Ronies, this is your pal Roni K95, and welcome back to do my new anime update for this month in December the 23rd, or 2017, because 2017 is going to be a biggest year, man, because we're going to head close to 2018 now, because, sure, because I'm going to have to do a year in review on the 31st. As let you know, y'all guys. So, what I'm we're doing, anyways, we're doing right now today was the bookstore pickups. There's some anime DVDs that I got, well, mostly from like used bookstores, like, and as well as half price bookstore and Barnes and Noble because, hey. But it's a hot... Oh, and Borders Bookstore back then. Because, you know, Borders Bookstore was a lot more better than Barnes & Noble back then. Because Borders Bookstore is a lot more better than Barnes & Noble. Because I miss... I remember going to Borders. Because... Well, anyways. That's just an old... That's an old story. Just so you know. Well, anyways. Let's get back to the review. The updates. The first one we have here is Cowboy Bebop's first session on DVD. This is the first volume, which is one of the six digital verse tile discs. See? That's the one. On the back, here's the spine. And, and on the back, it looks a, a lot like a vinyl record cover. And you, and you open it there, and you see the disc. It is basically like kind of like a vinyl record. There you go. Okay, the next one here. I have his second set, Cowboy Bebop session, second session. Volume 2 of the six digital various tile discs. This is the second Kali Bebop DVD series I got on DVD that I got at a used bookstore. Because I know this says 19... This is a 2000 release from... Bon, volume 2 on DVD I have. This is, it's a 2000 release from Bandai. Well, however, but the first volume on DVD... This was released in 1999, which is the first DVD of Kali Bebop. The second volume came out a year after 1999... But anyways, this is all I got. This is this is actually the same thing that like, includes character profiles on it. But hey, what can I say? I might as well rewatch Cowboy Bebop series, and then after the series is the movie, because Cowboy Bebop's the best. And next off to the last one here because. I already have looked back on Session 6, Session 4, and Session 5 of Cali View Up on DVD on the previous ones, like the the library book sale pickups and the record store pickups also, because I'll put the link in the description below at your leisure. Anyways, this is Cali Bebop, third session, volume three of the six digital verse tile discs. See? You got that. It has two part episodes, like Jupiter Jazz, which is part one and two on it. And yes, vo oh wait, and there's something reason about these. Volume two and volume three of Cowboy Bebop came out in like 2000. However, for the first volume, came out in like 1999. If you're an anime collector, get Pick up Cowboy Bebop. Because I know Beat Up the Anime Master has the box set of Cowboy Bebop. The Amazon exclusive one. DVD Blu-ray combo pack one. And as well as the Cowboy Bebop Remix Complete Collection DVD box set as well. I'll get those at your leisure for anime collecting. Okay. Um, the next one... Is Ghost in the Shell standalone? Um, 
not, not standalone complex. This is the Ghost in the Shell movie, I know. Got this for Christmas. You know, my girlfriend got this for me. When go, while going Christmas shop, while she was going Christmas shopping at Barnes and Noble, because she, she had probably got a hold of it. Well, yeah, because finally got it. And yes, it is based on the manga by Masume, Masamune Shiro and James Cameron, who done, who worked on Titanic and Avatar, said a stunning work of spectacular. Fiction, the first truly adult animation film to reach a level of literary and visual excellence. Yep. And Siskel and Ebert says two thumbs up. And Roger Ebert of Siskel and Ebert says, Unusually intelligent and challenging science fiction aimed at s smart audiences. Yeah, I can read critic reviews on there. This includes the making of, has a 30 minute program of the making of Ghost in the Shell and other good stuff. And, and, I, and this is a 1998 Bandai, no, no, not Bandai, it was manga video. This is a 1998 manga video release. I've seen Ghost in the Shell 2 Innocence, as well as Ghost in the Shell Standalone Complex, Ghost in the Shell Standalone Complex, Second Gig, and... The Laughing Man and Solid State Society. Oh, and the two and the live action movie as well. You know, with S Scarlett Johansson. You know, from Sing and Jungle Book, two thousand sixteen. Yeah, the live action one. But yeah, Ghost in the Shell. Check that out because I've read the manga that I borrowed from a library. Okay, the next one. Is Mobile Sim Gundam the eighth M the O eight the eighth MS Team Miller's report? This is actually like an anime anthology film, a compilation movie. Because the which my opinion about this DVD, this one is actually like my first anime DVD I got. Because I have probably gotten a hold of anime. Because I think I got this like I think two thousand three at Borders Bookstore, like. Which it was how many years ago? I got this for I got this like fourteen years ago at Borders Bookstore. Okay, the next one is round one of Mo volume one of Mobile Fighter G Gundam. My favorite. I dug this anime when I first saw it on Toonami back when it was on Cartoon Network back in the day. But I know this anime came out in 1994 after they finished making Mobile Suit Victory Gundam. And Mobile Fighter G Gundam lasted about like, I think like 44 episodes, 47, I don't know. Because I think they aired the last episode of Mobile Fighter G Gundam in 1995. Which is a the year before they were gonna make, I think Mobile Suit Gundam Wing, because I am way behind on this. I need to get more G Gundam views. Am I gonna fill my whole shelf up with just G Gundam? <laughs> but it's anime. But you're an anime collector like me for existence. I rewatched it twice on Toonami, as well as three times on Toonami when I was a kid. But when I kid. You know, when I come home from, you know, back in elementary school, back in, when I was coming home from grade school, and because I was going to watch Mobile Fighter G Gundam on Tsunami, along with other anime like Tenchi Muyo, Yu Yu Hakusho, Zoe's Dragon Ball, Dragon Ball Z, Roni Kenshin, other good anime I enjoyed. Check that out at your leisure. And next, we got Ninja Scroll. This is a, this is my first anime DVD I bought from Barnes & Noble, because... When, cause I, you gotta love Ninja Scroll, man. If I, I've watched it. I think it's. I find it pretty good. Because Ninja Scroll is the best anime. And yes, this was remastered from Sentai Film. This was released by Sentai Filmworks back in 2015. Because you might get the other ones like, at you know, like the manga entertainment. Well, this does have an English dub from the old manga video. Great.
great movie. Here's the cover. And here's the artwork on the DVD. Same. Yep, it's the same thing. Alright, because... What do we have here? Are... The first volume of Oh My Goddess, because I think this has like three episodes... Uh, Four episodes. I need to get the second volume because it has two more last episodes of Oh My Goddess OV8. And this was released by Animago. You know, that brought you Urusei Yatsura and other good shit from other anime. And I have volume two of Neon Genesis Evangelion because it has like... I think I finished the entire Neon Genesis Evangelion series because this is the... If you like 90s anime, pick up Neon Genesis Evangelion, because it's very emotional, because it has a good story plotline on each episode. And I have Bubblegum Crisis Tokyo 2040, because if you like the original Bubblegum Crisis, get Bubblegum Crisis Tokyo 2040, all as soon as I get more. Down to the last two, because, hold on. Okay, we got the last two here I got from... And these are from Half Price Bookstore. It has Blood the Last Vampire and the first volume of Halcyon DD. For the first volume of Halcyon DD has like three episodes. Blood the Last Vampire, they have come they have worked with contemporary, like traditional cell art animation by with use of computer generated imagery with hand drawn cell on art animation of the characters in this. But yeah. I bought these two from from Half Price Bookstore. So that's it all for today. For my anime reviews. Before I sign off. Here's a shit ton of 12 of these anime DVDs I got. For this video. On my video series of the bookstore pickups. I hope you like to comment, rate, subscribe, favorite. Put the comment sections below. And tell me what anime you're going to watch. That is your favorite.